Hi, this video solves um, a strange problem when you are developing in Angular or React and in this case, you see my browser, I'm doing a web request and I get the error fail to execute set request header on X, uh, XML HTM, uh, HTTP request string contains uh, ISO, ISO uh, 8859 and, and then something else. So this happens, uh, what you see here on my browser, I have a small login uh, and on this login I'm doing this one, I'm saying hey, I want to make a, a, a register, right, this one, and there and saying hey, I'm, I will throw my username, my email and password in there, in this case it's xxxxx, and this should work. There's the corresponding um, end at my web API. That's my web API and there's an endpoint like this one. And this says, okay, you're coming in with a username, email and so on. So, but it still fails. And the reason is, uh, should be simple. So what you see here, this on this side, on this browser, this browser uh, that's when I start my application that's when I I'm running this one when I start running from Visual Studio my uh, my application running to continue or to run then it opens uh, a browser element uh, as a debugger you see this small uh, the small uh, favorite bar on this one that's the debugger debugger browser and when you on the on this side it says okay this is my local app 7073 swagger i i o and i opened a, a second window a uh, tab on there and i started here i en entered my local host which is written on something else and here it is that's an application on angular but when you open, when you start here this uh, Angular application, when I stop this one, for example, Control C, then you will see uh, that it opens another window. When I start it, it, it starts another browser window. Uh, I'm going on with this one, with this arrow. So you see, this is my window, and I plop. There came my default browser. It opened my browser. Both are um, both are in this case my uh, Internet Explorer. You see here when this uh, icon, that's my Internet Explorer, and that's the other one. So both are open, but they they are, they are not the same. One is uh, for developing mode, and the other one is for my other stuff. So when I do it the same on here, on my default browser and when I run it on there I get the same uh, I go now to my register I say xxx xxx when I run it there it goes on and now we are it already switched into the back end and now I'm at the back end and it transmitted all my xxx values um, so I'm on this case this case works, this one does not work. So these browsers, these two browsers are different. One is for developing and it, the, the developing uh, machine does not transmit those um, password and all that stuff uh, in the right way. That's the uh, result on it.